Whoa, that's the animation. Oh! <laughs> it's literally the first player. Oh, oh, series right up. Boom. What did I say, bro? Pack and play squad. Hey, what's good? Welcome back. You guys are lucky. You guys are so lucky. You got two videos in this week. Also, look, I, I don't know why this is a meme now. Because I said Wheel of Mutt tomorrow. I said that like twice, twice ever. And one time I goofed and it was actually two days. And the other time I was totally right. I said Wheel of Mutt tomorrow and it came out the next day. And I keep getting the comment. So I'm going to redeem myself right here. And I'm going to tell you that tomorrow, November 20th, Wheel of Mutt. Wait, no, no, that's right. Tomorrow, November 20th, Wheel of Mutt is dropping. And it's a banger. So I hope you guys are stoked. But that's not what we're here for. We're here for the pack and play squad. Now they just dropped Autumn Blast. And I want to disregard everything Autumn Blast to go right here. The Cornucopia pack. The Cornucopia pack holds a very, very special place in my heart. Nothing in this world will beat the nostalgia and memories I have of Madden Mobile 15 opening up the Cornucopia pack set. It cost so many goddamn coins to get. Gotta love that name. Willie Brown, Cam Chancellor, Cam and Jordan, Robert Kelly. One. What's that for straight elite? That was so sexy. And you'd get one of three players. You'd either get a legendary Tony Romo. Dog shit. That was the horrible corny go back. Amon Green, 93, and 93 Barry Sanders. If you pull Barry Sanders, you made millions of coins. If you pulled Romo, you lost millions of coins. There's this huge gamble. There's also a bunch of other stuff in it. And this is a small resemblance of that. You get 189 plus player. Now, let me walk you through this pack. We're not going to open it right now, but let me walk you through it. If you get in this pack, team standouts, heavyweights, veterans, flashbacks, or rising stars, for the most part, it's horrible. That's not what you want, because all of those are like 89s or 90s but 89 plus player from the 50 that could be 93 ed reed like we saw myself pull that could be 93 ryan finneran that could be insanely good stuff autumn blast has 92 and 93 overall players team of the week has some insane players legends obviously has 92 93 players most feared yeah it's this pack that shit's i honestly am rock hard right now God fucking damn, nigga, like some motherfucking fresh ass baby back ribs, my nigga from the goddamn park. Like, I need to simmer down because, dude, you know when, like, you're about to go present in class and you just get rock hard and you don't want to go up there fucking on a hundo percent, if you know what I'm talking about? That's me with the cornucopia back. So I'm not standing up at any point during this video. I'm gonna open up the fight with that. I'm gonna open up the 14 times Autumn Blast Elite Bundle. I get 14 of these packs right here, the Autumn Blast Elite packs, and then one Fantasy Topper. So I'm pretty much guaranteed a really good player for this team. Although we're a goddamn 88 overall. It doesn't really matter. And then any of the Autumn Blast players that I do not use in this pack opening, I'm gonna quick sell for the leaves, and I'll open as many Cornucopia packs as I can with that. So dial in, strap in, buckle in. Just give me a banger. Strap on. I have major depression. Also want to give a huge thank you to Raycon for sponsoring today's video. I've worked with Raycon a ton, but if you're not familiar, let me clue you in. Raycon makes premium wireless earbuds. They come in a ton of awesome colors. They sound incredible. And celebrities like Snoop Dogg and J.R. Smith absolutely love them. The best part about Raycon earbuds is that they start at half the price of other premium wireless earbuds. They sound just as good and they look awesome. Plus, you don't have to break the bank. And as you know, the holiday season's coming up. I know you have to get gifts for people. Raycon is the perfect gift. Some of the features include six hours of playtime, easy Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and a more compact design. Also, right now, you can get the absolute best price on Raycon earbuds. But the offer is super limited, so you gotta act quickly. Click the link in the top of the description box right now. That'll get you 20% off your order. That's buyraycon.com forward slash MMG. Again, be quick. That deal is limited. But Raycon, thank you for sponsoring. And guys, enjoy the rest of the video. All right, baby, let's do this. Also, I love going to packs completely blind. Whoa, that's the animation. Whoa! <laughs> it's literally the first player of the first pack. Oh my God, and I got it again. Dude, does it look like that animation is glitching? Like, is that supposed to be part of the animation or is it kind of like lagging? You, you see what I mean? I don't know, maybe that's supposed to be part of it though. We're gonna get... So I think we get, yeah, you're guaranteed an 85 plus and an 80 plus elite. So the fact that we already pulled Allen Robinson, sheesh, man. 
Lawrence Taylor, Ben Garland, Miles Gaskin, Seymour. Now, I will say, it didn't look like the 92 animation was any different than the 8280 animation. So I wonder if there is a big animation at all. Like, is there a big animation for the Harrison Smith? There is a 93 overall Harrison Smith that you can pull right now. We will find out soon enough. We're gonna get Gilmore, Flowers, Anderson. A quick sell ball to end. I think there's a really good chance we'll have a lot of cornucopia packs though. Leonard Williams, Lawrence Taylor. Dude, I'm on an Xbox Series X. Why does this pack animation feel like it's lagging? Do you see that? I don't know, maybe I'm being a bitch. Tom Brady, get out of my packs, dude. If I pull Tom Brady, he's always in this slot too. It's seriously some demon shit. It's scary. Trey Boston. Yeah, I'm sure they're gonna come out with a lot more really cool limiteds in this program. This is like the very start of it. So there might be actually two pack and play episodes just on this one promo. But you guys probably wouldn't see that until we get a little closer to Thanksgiving. Noah Fant, Villanueva. We burnt our pack luck right there at the start. Although, honestly, I just think it's crazy rare to get a 92 anyway. I'm really pulling this. Ah! Oh! I thought... <laughs> I thought I was still in a regular pack. This is the topper. I didn't open 14 packs already, though, did I? There's no way. But this is the topper. I'm guaranteed one of these dudes. I like Pat Pete. Let me compare. How many good corners do I have? Right? All right, you can compare. So I have Cromarty, Murphy Bunting, Ed Reed. I think I might go Pat Pete here. Yeah, let's go Pat Pete. Pat Pete's the stuff. We got Cromarty on one side and Patrick Peterson on the other side. That's dope. There's no way I opened all those packs already. That just can't be right. Oh my God, I did? We zoomed through those. Well, that's fine. You guys are going to get more uh, more percentage video gameplay. Allen Robinson. Awesome pull. That's going to be great. I mean, I do have really good wide receivers already, but he'll be my best one right now. Let me see his stats. Hopefully, he has at least 89 speed. 88 speed, 90. 91 jump yeah i mean he'll still be really good but when there's a 92 speed dk metcalf it's kind of tough to want this patrick peterson is gonna have crazy stats though i already know they oh yeah they gas these cards so hard 91 speed 91 excel 91 yes shit's nuts i'm gonna hit best lineup on my team oh yeah i forgot that with the series x you can actually switch around your team without like the whole game break that is very nice. All right, so let's give Patrick Peterson at least Acrobat. I don't really mess with any of the other abilities in this game. At least as far as corners go. Eh, Lurker's pretty goddamn good though. Nah, let's just go Acrobat. Let's not get fancy. All right, so defensively, we got Ed Reed with Lurker Acrobat, Cromartie with Acrobat, Pete with Acrobat, Murphy Bunting with Acrobat, TJ Watt, Edge Threat. And that is nine ability points. So I could actually, if I ever get a good free safety on this team, which hopefully I will, I'll give them Acrobat too, and that's 10. Offensively, I don't think I got anything new as of right now other than Allen Robinson. And then I think Cortland Sutton's gonna like get minorly benched here. Oh wait, no, he has 88 speed also? Ah, Cortland Sutton's staying in there. All right, so my starting wide receivers now are Diop, Cortland Sutton, Allen Robinson. I like this a lot. All right, now here's what really counts. We could truly, we could whiff so bad and just completely fumble the bag on these packs, but we're gonna give it a go. So I'm gonna go program, autumn blast, I'm gonna click sell everything that's not currently in the lineup, which is gonna be a lot of stuff. None of these guys have a slot on the team. Yo, so I got a shit ton of leaves and I got 17,000 from that pack opening. And it's 4,000 for a cornucopia pack. Now, if I wanted to be a super ultra mega chooser every time i got a player in this that i didn't like i could probably quick sell them too but i don't want to sit here and open 30 of these ah it is pack and play though we'll figure it out as we go our first cornucopia pack i've waited so long it's a legend oh shit dude i was saying how getting legends would be good in this and honestly it is but dan marino is not what we want and it being dan marino quick sells for training and not fallen leaves ouch our first one is not he let me see a good animation baby another legend player okay yes okay okay i can work with that i can absolutely work with that reggie wayne he's actually gonna be he's gonna be better than uh courtland sutton for sure so that is our new wide receiver dude i would have cried if i got like another quarterback oh oh series read up boom what did i say bro what did i say about getting a new free safety i'd be willing to bet when i upgrade him too that i can oh did that cut out fire that carter is so fire let's go that was the perfect pull that was literally the perfect pull look and i can i can switch him to free safety secondary position so now he can get x factors over there all right all i gotta do is give him acrobat let's go boys dude i'm lit that makes me so happy so strong safety john lynch but he'll get bopped over to free safety without any penalties and we have one final cornucopia pack left after getting a set we get another series redux come on baby Brittany cooks this card is so fast, I think. I think this is... Oh.
Dude, I'm actually a god. So my first two cornucopias just fall. And then we hit that. Oh my god, it's dumb season. Dude, I have like too many good players on this team. John Lynch now at free safety. Gonna activate Acrobat here. 89 overall. This god, this is the best team I've ever played with. This is like close to a god squad. It's literally only from packs. I did not buy a single player on this team. Like, yeah, sometimes I'll log on to people's accounts when they have a 99 overall team to do it for a video. But me personally, I've only ever had like a Wheel of Mutt team and then like sometimes a pretty decent team. This is the best team I've ever used. Dude, and it's so perfect to have a most feared D-Hop after what he did yesterday. Oh my God. I'm not even gonna ask if you guys saw D-Hop Hail Mary catch because I know you did. All right, 89, 89, 89. This team is nuts. If I lose this game now, I don't think I'll show my face on YouTube. Also, I don't know if you've seen the video where I talk about this yet, but I'm using this like super pro controller for today's video. I'm excited to see how it goes. All right, there's our top three. He's got Harrison Smith. Damn, he got that Harrison Smith quick. He's trying them out. Harrison Smith versus Ed Reed, the two best strong safeties in the game. Let's see TJ Watt have another monster game. He played so well last week. Let's see what we can do here. All right, dig coming across the middle. Got it. Another dig coming across the middle. Oh, that was me, Joe Green. That might be his first sack. Uh-oh, uh-oh, that's open. Ah, oh wait, no, it's not. Let's go, the new Pat P. This game's over. We should see an early rage quit. I should hope. Oh my God, are we gonna return this? Oh. Took it back all the way to the 14. I think this will be D-Hop or Jimmy Graham for the touchdown. Maybe not. We just go underneath and go Ty Gurley. Juke out the Harrisons. Slowest juke in the world, but you know what? It's second and seven. I do not like halfback zone week as a play, but if he's not ready for it, it'll still be good. Oh, is that Stafford? Uh-oh. Shit, that's bad. Oh! Stafford! Oh! Dude, Stafford really just swerved. 93 overall Harrison Smith. Come on. Yup, dusted him. God, that Diop is so good. Great start. Back out on defense. He goes with the slip screen. I'm on DJ Reader. DJ Reader. My 90 overall most feared D tackle just did that. Yup, he's going with slants. He fumbles again and he picks it up. All right, we're just going to go cover two. We're going to take over everything underneath. There's nothing you can throw. This is over. <laughs> Dude, I actually usered that all the way down the field. I knew exactly where he was going. He's dropping the boys early. Oh, God. What is this game? It is 14 to zero. Excellent play, gentlemen. Matt Stafford, fake PAT holder blast. Although I am a little confused because they usually sub in the backup quarterback for that play, right? Because in Wheel of Mutt, it always puts in my Russell Wilson instead of my Josh Allen. I don't know why I did that. Doesn't matter, he got the swerve. What is my matchmaking? What actually, you're telling me that team is going up against my team. Yeah, he's just gonna quit right out the gates. Honestly, that makes them all, oh, oh, oh my God. Wait, 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 wait. So that last guy rage quit, this guy just quit. I'm six and one. Ladies and gentlemen, if I win this next game, we officially will reset the pack and play team. Now here's how it works. By making the playoffs is how I know a team needs to reset or not. I'm still gonna try my best with this team to go all the way to the Super Bowl and win it. But let's say I lose in the NFC Championship. In that, in the season that comes after that, the team has to be completely reset. So if I win this game and make the playoffs, this may be one of the last episodes that you see with this team. This one, we had a rage quit, another win, and now we're about to get our third win, hopefully. Andre Johnson, 97 overall, Sam Mills. I take it back, boys. I might not make the playoffs here. Yeah, the only good thing I got out of that was the fact that Allen Robinson was wide open. Oh, uh, no, he ran a different defense. This is so bad. This guy's gonna murder me. Ooh, D-Hop is actually open. That's not bad. You know what? We might be able to get something, boys. Fourth and seven. Oh, oh, beat him, Dave. Let's go. Maybe I can, baby. Maybe I just can do it. Jimmy Graham. Wow, I can't believe I caught that guy sleeping. Starts out with a counter run. Oh my God. Probably something similar. I mean, you got so many yards. Why would you switch it up? Wow, that's a good play. Throws underneath, got him. No, it's a slip screen, but we're under it. Oh my God, Mean Joe Green just made the play of the game. Fourth and 10, he's calling some hot routes. He's got a slant, he dropped it. He got a really good shot here. First and 10. Oh, Matt Stafford just got zoomed on by Lawrence Taylor. Let's just see how this sets up. Oh my God, Allen Robinson. 
Dude, we're killing this guy deep. Why am I toasting this guy? Second and goal, I wanna try and redeem myself on the run game. Okay, maybe I will. He guesses the left side. He guesses wrong and we're gonna get it. Thank you. Stretch left, stretch right. Yeah, I know I'm a bitch. I don't have a good reason for going for this. I just want to. Uh, can I rifle that? No, don't you return that. No. Play action here for Lamar Jackson. None of this looks open. He's gonna throw a sketchy one. Five ball. Let's see how this sets up. I'm thinking Jimmy Graham will be there. I think he is. Gunslinger. Yep. Damn. Cooks got mirrored. I think Robinson's there. No. He toe tapped himself out of the first. I'm pretty sure that's gonna happen. Oh no, but I do have Jimmy Graham. Ah! No, he rolled. No, he runs a pitch. Uh oh, that's got daylight. That's got daylight. All right, ooh, good swerve. Great swerve. At least we stopped the touchdown. I got the stuff in the middle kind of covered. Oh, nobody on the deep row. Allen Robinson was the yard behind it, and then so is my tight end. He misses the PAT, which is big for me. So I missed the two point. I don't know what's gonna happen on this play, but I just wanna try it. Oh. Thank you, thank you. Why are we burning him on every play? Wait a second, holy shit, this is sketchy, but. I'm the greatest! <laughs> e, can I get this throw off? <gasps> I'm so good right now! I think he's going for a one play beater. Shit. Shit. Oh, okay, we're good. Dude, I was so worried there. Wait a second. Let's try and return this. 20 to 6. I think we I think we're gonna win this game. He called the timeout on this play to run a, a slip screen that he throws into the middle. Uh -huh. Let's see how this goes. I got this covered. I got the wheel. He throws. Oh. Playing the whole field with John Lynch. He throws the slip screen. He's getting solid blocks. Oh my God, Derrick Henry is so much faster than I imagined. Oh, you're gonna showboat? Second and 10, let's see how this sets up here. Uh, Ty Gurley wide open. I don't think I've ever thrown for this many yards on this many passes. I'm averaging like 28 yards of throw. I just need the man not to fumble. Good, good, stud. All right, let's see which side he bites on. Easy, oh, can you get the first kill? Ah! Come on, let's go. It doesn't really matter what I do here. Wow, you miss some, you lose some, baby. I'm literally just holding on to, dude, he is fighting his ass off. 23-13, that's huge. It is, it is slip screen again. He's really obsessed with this play right now. Oh, come here. If this is slip screen, I'll actually go on it. Okay, it's not. Catches a very lucky ball. He loves the slip screen. He's not going slip screen. Peter, black's taken, baby. Third and 18, dude. TJ Watts not even having a good game, but it doesn't matter. It clearly doesn't matter. Ah. Man, this guy is the split screen. He's a slip screen guru. He's running it so well. Ah, it's not either. Step up! Let's go! Goal line stand! Let's go! All right, first and 10. This is actually kind of sketchy. If he gets in the... Oh, he didn't. He didn't. We're good. If he had gotten in the backfield there... But yeah, this game's over. I would like to get Stafford above 300 passing yards, so I will throw one drag. Oh, he said good game, bro. It was a hell of a game. Hey, Votive Tiara. GG, bro. I don't know if you're a subscriber or not, but hey. I'm gonna try and get this one little little dinky one to Graham. Oh, damn it. This guy's nice. I'll end this game. Wait, is this guy joking? <laughs> Wait, this dude has 97 Sam Mills. Unless... The only good player on his team is the 97 Sam Mills. The Roy Glover, Lawrence Taylor, Sam Mills, Anthony Barr, Jamal Adams. Well, I guess it's not a God squad. I think we have the exact same overall. He's got 91 Lamar, 93 Derrick Henry, 91 Max Strong, 9... What is this dude smoking? His team is so much better than mine. Look at this offensive line. This dude's team is 100 times. 94 Anthony Barr, 97... Oh my god, what are you smoking, bro? He said, OMG, my team is 92. I think he probably just thought it was a super team because he saw like, oh, I guess I don't know what he thought he saw. What did I say? I said, we 
are going to the playoffs. And as of this episode, we're going to the playoffs. So I hope you guys love this team because the next time that I lose in the pack and play squad, we will have a brand new team. Now I am considering a wheel of mutt clause where I can carry over one player from the last pack and play. I don't know if I'm going to do that or not. I might. That is one hell of a game. We had 145 rushing yards, but we had 282 passing. Average 10 and a half and three takeaways. That's how you win a ball game right there. All right, boys. I love you. I'll see you in the next pack and play episode. I'll think about the rules and it'll be playoffs. So playoff season, baby. Love you, boys. Peace.